The first half has just begun. Come on, Chelsea, let's get closer to qualifying for the last 16 of this beautiful competition. Come on, you blues. It's Chelsea nil, it's Ajax 1. This is the worst possible start in which we could have made. Um, I'm not entirely sure who put the ball in the back of the net for Ajax. Um, it did look as though it took a deflection from a free kick. But yes, um, it's Chelsea nil, it's Ajax 1. Chelsea have won themselves a penalty. It's Chelsea 1, it's Ajax 1. It's been an absolutely ludicrous start to the match. Jorginho scores from a penalty spot. It's an absolutely brilliant penalty. He sends the Ajax goalkeeper to rock the wrong way and he slots it into the bottom corner. And like I said, it's Chelsea 1, it's Ajax 1. I have just seen a replay of the Ajax goal. It did take a deflection off of Tammy Abraham's shin. I'm not entirely sure if that will go down as an own goal because a few years, a few years ago I, I heard that um, own goals from free kicks don't count but I'm not entirely sure if the law has changed since then. But yes, the ball did take a deflection off of Tammy Abraham's leg so that could go down as a Tammy Abraham own goal. It's Chelsea 1, it's Ajax 2. Quincy Promes has the ball into the back of the net from close range after a brilliant ball from the opposite side of the pitch. We really should have defended it a lot better, but there's still a lot of the game to go and we could still get something from this, but we'll just have to we'll just have to do something about this because we've not been at our best so far in this match. But yes, it's Chelsea 1, it's Ajax 2. Willian wins Chelsea a free kick in the left wing position. Can we get an equaliser? Let's hope so. Christian Pulisic takes the free kick. It comes to nothing. His cross was far too deep and it was far too close to the goalkeeper. But hopefully he keeps on trying. It's Chelsea 1, it's Ajax 3. Hakim Ziyech curls the ball into the back of the net from the right wing position after Marcos Alonso brought down one of the Ajax players and conceded a free kick in the exact same position in which Hakim Ziyech struck from. But yes, um, we have not been at the races at all in this first half. It's Chelsea 1, it's AFC Ajax 3. Less than 8 minutes plus additional time left at the end of the first half. We are into one minute of additional time at the end of the first half. It's half time, it's Chelsea 1, it's Ajax 3, not a good first half by any means. We've not been good enough in the defensive third or the attacking third. In the attacking third, we've done next to nothing besides the goal. The only other chance in which I believe we had was the Marcos Alonso shot, which um, came in the, in the latter stages of the half. But yes, I'll see you all for the second half where hopefully we play a lot better than we did in the first. The second half has just begun. Chelsea have made a change at half time, which sees Rhys James come on for Marcos Alonso, which means that Cesar Aspilicueta will be moving over to the left back position, which has been vacated by Marcos Alonso, of course. But yes, come on, you blues. Let's get something from this game and let's score some brilliant goals. Come on, come on. Chelsea have made a great start to the second half so far, but we need to get those goals. We have created a few chances, a few clear cut chances shall I say, but they have not been put in the back of the net. Hopefully we can push on and get some goals, but we'll just have to see. Come on Chelsea. And all our good work in the second half so far has come to nothing. It's Chelsea 1, it's Ajax 4, Donny van der Beek puts the ball into the back of the net from the right hand side of the box. It's a clinical finish, it's a great finish. I don't think Kepa could have done anything about that. I don't think it was his fault either. We should have, our, defender should have, our defender should have done a lot better with it in terms of clearing it. I actually think it takes a deflection off of um, Kurt Zuma. Yes it does, but um, yes. It's Chelsea 1, it's Ajax 4, not good. Callum hudson has come on for Mason Mount due to injury. 
It's Chelsea 2, it's Ajax 4. So as Aspel Kratzer puts the ball into the back of the net from close range after a good bit of play and for the way and after the way we've played in the second half so far, it's a goal we deserved. But let's go and get two more and hopefully get another one after that. I, I highly doubt that we will, but we'll just have to see. Chelsea have won themselves a penalty and Ajax have had two of their players sent off. I believe it's both of their central defenders, so I do not know what's going to happen in terms of their tactics at the moment or or, in, or after this penalty is being taken. But yes, Jorginho will be taking it. It's Chelsea 3, it's Ajax 4. The comeback is on. Jorginho puts the ball into the back of the net from the penalty spot and he sends Onana the wrong way yet again. Brilliant penalty, straight into the bottom corner, and like I said already, it's game one. Come on, come on. Hakim Ziyech and David Neres have gone off the pitch for Ajax. I'm not entirely sure who for. I'll let you guys know when I do actually see who, see who they've gone off for. But yes, um, the game has restarted. It's Chelsea 3, Ajax 4. Rhys James has won Chelsea another corner on the right hand side. <laughs> David Neres and ha Hakim Ziyech have gone off for Edson Alvarez and Per Schurz. First goal in Champions League, isn't it? For it's four. Chelsea 4, it's Ajax 4. Rhys James gets his first ever Champions League goal and what, a abs what an absolutely brilliant hit it was. I can't even speak, I'm almost lost for words right now. Um, we've not even been playing that great in this game, but yes, we thoroughly deserve this goal. Um, the corner comes in, I believe it's Kurt, Kurt Zuma who gets ahead on it. It does hit um, the crossbar, I think it is. Yes, it hits the crossbar. And then what, what does Reese James do? He gets the ball and fires it into the bottom corner. And yes, like I said already, we thoroughly deserve that goal for the way we've played in the second half so far. And it's 4-4. Let's go and get a winner and kill these lot off. Come on, Chelsea. Uh, he, uh, he gave a corner away. Cesar Aslan puts the ball into the back of the net, but it doesn't count yeah, because, because he must have handballed it. I saw the replay and it's unlucky because the ball took a deflection off of his um I mean he controlled the ball with his thigh and it just bounced off it just bounced onto his hand. I don't think that should have been disallowed, but th that's just what we're gonna have to deal with now. It's still four four. Less than six minutes plus additional time left at the end of the match. Chelsea's final substitution sees Michi Batshuayi replace Mateo Kovacic. And I think Mateo Kovacic has had a decent game. But yes, that is Chelsea's final substitution of the match. We are into four minutes of additional time at the end of the match. It's full time, the final score is Chelsea 4, Ajax 4, it was an absolutely ridiculous game of football, it had everything, it had some good goals, it had decisions go against both sides, you may argue, it had, got, it had disallowed goals, it had everything, but yes, um, I don't know how to feel about this game to be honest, but I'll see you all for my review.